Man, it's hard to see. It is. Walk by the creepy old place. I am. Man, that... Up on the front porch and all, baby. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> hey! Oh, you should go to the, um... <laughs> go to the hotel. Oh, the, yeah. Yeah. You see, Which I is... I took the hammer and I tried yeah. to hit the door. Which is in... Yeah. Yeah, I'll go to the, up there. Because I bet everything's closed here anyways. Yeah. Let's go up. Let's see what... Oh, yeah. My bad, guys. Forgot about the old run <laughs> button. Excuse me. You, you, I could just hear the fans. are like, what's going on? Like, you figured out how to run. Now do it. I'm sorry. It's taking so long. You spent an hour fucking off hitting the, hitting the <laughs> door with a hammer and walking slow. I know. Like, jeez, man. Learn to play Glenier Heights. Oh. Hey, I'm learning. <laughs> It's oh, to the left, remember? Yeah, the yeah. dude's not running it, though. Yeah. Ah, he's, he's in here. here. All right. Let's talk to him and see. Keith, please enjoy one of our fine drinks. Where? Can I really get one? Talk to him over the counter. Maybe you can buy one. Nope. Talk see, that's what I did earlier, to walk, yeah. walk behind the counter. Talk to him again, maybe. Keith, please enjoy <laughs> one of our fine drinks. There's another guy. Oh. See? Standing oh. between the tables. Oh. Agent. Mr. Keith. I'm Special Agent Deacon Troopel. Welcome to the town. I won't bother you with any questions since you are new here. But if you see anything out of the ordinary, let me know. Mr. Anderson. Yeah. People are more relaxed when having a drink. I know I need one sometimes. Mr. Thorn sure has a great establishment here. As a character, I feel that he's a bit more layered than the average person should be. That's a little breaking fourth wall as a character. I, I think he means like his character. Oh, I yeah. guess, yeah. But then again, he is not an average person. Sorry. Okay, I'm going to have to go. <laughs> I just want to make sure because he actually said something different. Yeah. So. All right, and uh, keep on rocking in the free world. While I'm here, I might as well see uh, what's out and about. I decided to stay out late for a reason. Yeah. What up, buddy? Finding a hobby is important. Once in a while, you must be able to take your mind off work. Time doesn't fly when you're indoors. No. I just noticed that. It really doesn't. No, like, see, it's... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, I, I noticed yeah. that when you said that, I was like, no, it doesn't. I, I didn't mean it metaphorically. Yeah. I mean it literally. Okay. Yeah. See, this door doesn't have a welcome mat. You're right. And it doesn't show that it's... It doesn't show that it's locked, but you can't open it. Huh. All right, well... Guess it's time to uh, head on back. Yeah. Nothing like a nice run to end the day. Who? Who's that? Oh, Emily. Hey, are you in a hurry? Don't rush it. Things will stay pretty much the same even if you arrive there ten minutes later. Mm hmm. What if you miss a plane or a train? Uh. That's not it. There you go. Look for the lights. All right. Oh. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> that happens. Uh, uh, that was a bit of a glitch. <laughs> okay, cool. All right. Boom. Boom. Cool. Oh. Good morning, Keith. I just wanted to let you know about something. There are various improvement projects for the town that lack funding to be completed. If you are interested in contributing, visit me any day from 1900 to 2100 and take a look at them. Might be something we Man, do. that's late at night. That was all. Have a nice day. Where would the mayor be? In his house. That, that one house that he walked out of? Hmm. 
That doesn't appear to be City Hall here, so... Oh, I didn't check the dang day. Oh, yeah. Hello, this is tomorrow's weather. Sunny spring day. But that's tomorrow's. Today's is oh. a sunny spring day. Hey, turnips! You have turnips. Oh, my God! Oh, I got a freaking turnip, baby! I got a turnip! Woo! All right. Time to sell these. Get out of the way. <laughs> I gotta sell these things. There you go. Yay! All right. There we go. And back. And let's go ahead and do you this. You have your hammer equipped. Oh, that might be bad. Yeah, you, you didn't put it in here. There you go. Let me water this. Wham! <laughs> That's oh. not a hedgehog. Oh, no. All right, let's... Accuracy is very important. So the first thing I would upgrade would probably be your hammer. Yeah. And the second thing would probably be your watering can. So you can water more spaces? Yeah. Usually level two, you can water like a line of three. And then level three, you can water six. And then level four, you can water nine. I don't know how it works here, but watering nine by nines is really useful. Or not nine by nines, three, three by threes. Um, nine by nines, that'd be amazing. Yeah. Um, but since you plant a single seed at a time, um, this three by three planting, like planting bed kind of thing, may not be the best method. Probably since you plant a single seed at a time, rows would be a better method. Good call. So the... You don't want to plant them all up, though, because you can't walk through your your plants. Oh, yeah, that's right. So that's why you left one space out, and that's actually still going to be problematic because yeah. when that one you just planted grows, you won't be able to water the middle one. Oh, yeah. Yoy, yoy, yoy. So um, I think after you get these, all, all the rest that are there grown. Um, no, 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 stop it. Yeah. A, a good idea would be to... Um, start rowing. Yeah, start planting them in rows. So... Well, you farm and you learn. Yeah. Just like that ill-advised planting right there. Hopefully they'll grow in... In time. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe fill this water thing up. And then uh, I think what I'll do is... Uh, Definitely go check out the uh, what the mayor says. Well, that's later tonight, nineteen yeah. to twenty-one. So, yeah. what are you gonna do till then? Well, gonna go ahead, Chaga smashing. Probably. <laughs> Probably. Let's go ahead and get it right. See how much we progress. That's what I was about to say. Oh, not bad. Um, press go on hammer. Press the right arrow button. On the D-pad. Oh, okay. Okay. I was just interested to see if it would give you a list of mm -hmm. uh, possible perks. Oh. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Hedgehog Hunt. I'm your host, Keith. With my mighty hammer equipped, these hedgehogs will taste nothing but hammerhead mallet. Here we go. Oh, and I missed. <laughs> oh, but he did. Boy, they're feisty today, ladies and gentlemen. All right. What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? That's right. Sometimes they don't even react when you hit them. They're just like, okay, whatever. I give up. <laughs> I don't like when they hide in the trees. Oh, but... Like when I hit him with the hammer. They're like little spiky ambushes. Just waiting. There you go. I think that's half the trick is sometimes you don't think they're gonna respond, you move and then you're like, oh well they don't care. Uh you're you're a little far, far south for oh no, you can still get to the clearing. Yeah. yeah. There you go. There's another. I gotcha, buddy. Uh-huh. I saw that. I didn't see that one. <laughs> Oh, jeez. They're rather feisty today. Man, that, that hedgehog is... Uh, He's 
a little pussy. Yeah. He, he deserves a medal. He's hit you like three times. There you go. Oh! They traded hits there. He was on to you. Yeah. There you go. I'm actually gonna go see if I can get some more of those green herbs if they're over there. Green herbs. Yeah, probably. It seems like they kinda respawn. Yeah, I think they grow once per day. Oh! I saw you shaking it. <laughs> there you go. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead that way. Yeah. Then there's those uh, slimes. Yeah, the worms. See, we're at uh, 217. Not horrible. Not bad. What, you've got. Those like, turnips, man. Hopefully they'll. Bring sell back for a lot? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you've gotta kill like 180 more hedgehogs before. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you can afford a single chicken. <laughs> So let me ask you this, in normal games like this, I buy a chicken, like when they lay eggs, does it like typically produce more chickens or I just gotta... So you have a, you typically have a choice. Um, you can sell the eggs or you can incubate the eggs. Mm. So usually the first egg I get, I incubate. Um, that way you end up with two chickens and you double your chicken income. Right. The biggest problem is feeding them because they do cost... Um, like, I don't know if you can feed your chickens cut grass in this one. Um, if you can, that'll be good. Um, because then it's, it's cheap. It's re renewable, like, chicken food. Yeah. Because the chicken food is actually kind of expensive. It was like 25. 20. Yeah. That's probably a chicken each day. Yeah. I guess that's so. me killing head dogs to afford feeding this stupid things. <laughs> but usually, um, well, that's like five hedgehogs a day per chicken. Um, <laughs> yeah. Four hedgehogs. <laughs> we're, we're figuring in, like, your budget based on hedgehogs. Hedgehogs. <laughs> um, oh, there's some more fat. Hey, that's a good thing. I don't know if that sells for a whole lot. I don't think it does. I know. Um, cause you sold, you had like one, two. yeah, you had 125, you sold two and you ended up with 127. Yep. So maybe there's another use for that fat. I don't know. Um, oh, there's another one. There's another. So walk along the north bank of that pond. You still haven't gone all the way. Right. Or I don't remember if you've gone no, all the way. No, I haven't yet. actually. So... Um, but once you have chickens that are producing eggs, you get pretty steady, like steady money. Mm -hmm. So usually a chicken egg sells for more than the cost of their feed. So. So what came first, Carl? Chicken or the egg? Um. <laughs> I, scientifically. I don't know. <laughs> probably the chicken. Um. <laughs> philosophically, that's uh, a stupid question. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I asked. That. <laughs> that's why I laughed immediately after I did. All right, so I guess that'll be it for that. Well, I did notice. Go up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, never mind. I thought I saw a way to get onto that little plateau, but I might have been wrong. Yeah, because that's where the piranha plant and shit was up there. Yeah. So. Well, it's. We got a little bit of time. Yeah, you're just wasting time too. You can talk to the mayor. No. Oh, come on, people. Oh, oh, there it is. My man, Carl. Now you're in piranha plant country. All right. All right. What oh. the f- Okay. What is this, Binding of Isaac? <laughs> Like I said earlier, yeah. wrong with my poop. Oh, wow. I mean, I know what you're trying to do, but I don't like it. Oh, you missed. Oh, yeah. Wow. That's what my life has come to. I'm trying to hit spitting flies with a hammer. If I ever came oh, across a fly that spit a little red bullet at me, I would definitely leave the area I was in. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm still like chasing it. Like, come here. It's either a giant rock or a potato up there.
Thank you, ladies and gents, for your continued support on the Late Night Grind. Please like, share, and subscribe as it is greatly appreciated. And as always, long live Player 2.